Hi, and welcome to The Property Show. Today, it's all about the just-concluded World Class Expo brought together by Luxury Living and Design. This expo connected top-of-the-range partners across the real estate value chain from real estate companies, developers, architects, interior designers, furniture makers, landscape gardeners to home accessory companies. Later on, the expert segment highlights the upset home loan and beatable offer. Our loan tenors are one of the longest in the market. Can you imagine uh, having flexible terms up to 25 years? We'll also get to hear experiences on home ownership journeys. Do your homework, compare, make sure that everything checks out. For me, key was children not having to sleep on the road in the morning mm. or sleep on the road on the evening. We tie it all up with the property gallery, bringing a sneak peek of other investment opportunities available at First Avenue, our real estate arm. Our telephone lines and social media handles are open. We are ready for your questions and comments. Keep them coming. As always, there is something for everyone. Today, it's all about the latest emerging trends across the real estate value chain, featured at the just concluded Luxury Living and Design Expo. Our property pick of the week kicks off with Africa's first iconic residential condominium, 88, by shoot location. This new iconic skyscraper has 44 high-end residential apartments, including a studio, one and two bedroom apartments, and three, four to six bedroom penthouses, providing the epitome of finesse. Let's get more information. My main activity is real estate. The project we have started, and you, you all know, is 88 Nairobi. 88 Nairobi is going to be the tallest high-end residential building in Africa. It's 44 floors. Um, and it's on top of Upper Hill, so the views are amazing. One way you can see Kilimanjaro, the other way you can see Mount Kenya, and then you can see the Abadeas on the other direction. So this is a phenomenal, and we have executive apartments which come fully furnished, and where we are here, the, all the furniture here is what is all included in the price. And then uh, we have studios, one beds and two beds. And then above it, we have executive plus and penthouses. We have the, a huge swimming pool. Um, and we have a lot of amenities here. We have the lounge area, we have a convenience store, we have restaurants, we have guest rooms here. So they're guest rooms and it's really like a five-star hotel. What's really good for investors is that in Upper Hill, we have 40,000 people working there, but we have no, there's no good uh, quality accommodation. So you've got the World Bank, you've got the embassies, you've got Britam, you've got a lot of uh, in, uh, big companies but there is no high quality residential in Upper Hill. And we are the first, and uh, we basically are taking the whole market. So this will be uh, a much easier to rent out. You don't have competition like in Westlands and Kilimani, you've got so many apartments uh, competing with you. Here there's, very, there's no competition really. So it's a really, really good investment. Another interesting project featured at the Expo is Sinina Residency, conveniently located in the high sought after neighborhood of Kililishwa. This development has 77 opulent residences, thoughtfully constructed with separate domestic living quarters, offering great views of the Nairobi skyline. Let's find out more.
Senina Real Estate. We are uh, developers based on Milimani Road. We are selling our Senina residency. These are apartments, high-end luxury apartments based on Tinderet Avenue, Kileleshwa. We have three, four, five and six bedroom apartments starting from 2,400 square feet all the way to 6,500 square feet. They are quite spacious and luxurious. You should invest in Sinina Residency because of the location, number one, it's quite um, accessible. Number two, it's serene, it's next to many hospitals, schools. Um, the space is uh, quite large for this area. In Sinina, the amenities you'll find are we have a swimming pool, we have a gym area separated for men and women, we have 24-hour security, we have a garden area, we have an entertainment area on the rooftop, kids playing area, which is quite spacious. Sinina Residency is an ongoing project, it's off plan. It should be finished on December 2022. Our show house will be ready on uh, September this year, 2021. In Sinina Residency, we believe that uh, people should get value for the price they are paying. So that's why the spaces are quite large. You should enjoy the space in your house and all the amenities that we have to offer. Home is where the palm tree is. Palm Valley, another new development, handpicked during the expo. Nestled a few minutes from Gigiri, this development combines urban sophistication in an exquisite suburban location. Here is more. Century City Property is a developer and a seller of uh, high-end luxury housing. Uh, the moment on this uh, expo, we are showcasing Palm Valley. It's a development that is coming up uh, on the lower end of Runda. Very high-end, ex executive kind of housing. Really targeting the top 1% of the population and uh, offering uh, good uh, solutions to housing. In terms of units, we have three types of units. We sit on 20 acres. We have uh, villas, we have apartments, we have townhouses. Our villas sit on a third of an acre each with a very good high-end finishing. It comes with an option of a swimming pool as well. The villas are four and five bedroom. And apart from villas now, we have apartments also within. All the apartments are three bedroom with an SQ. And uh, the townhouses come in uh, three and four bedroom. Each unit sits on about 50 by 100 on the townhouses. And apart from housing, Palm Valley really is, is uh, selling your lifestyle. It's more of a gated community that has life within. The Luxury Living and Design Expo confirms luxury and high quality designs are available right at our doorsteps. Next, the organizers take of the event. Today we are hosting Luxury Living and Design Expo, which is an opportunity and a platform for Kenyan uh, developers, architects, landscapers, and in general exhibitors that have to see with luxury living and design lifestyle to expose their products to people coming from all over the country and other places. Our purpose is to bring Kenyans to Kenyans. Basically what we want is to connect exhibitors with the opportunities uh, that they can find in the market in terms of new customers, new clients, and different kind of things that they can find. But what we are aiming is to reach people who are interested in getting things for the new homes, getting things for the new developments, getting things for what they want for their loved ones, 
in terms of uh, renovations, new development, and different things in that things. For that, we want to reach out to the Kenyan market and also to other people who are living in the country and who will be interested in having or getting things for their homes. Kenyan market is very interesting because people love luxury lifestyle, they love to renovate their homes, they love to have nice spaces and there are a lot of nice and interesting and innovative solutions coming up in the market. Our aim is to recreate an experience that has international standards, that is made for Africans, and by Africans, and to repeat it annually in order to grow the specialization in the hospitality and also landscaping and furniture and luxury living lifestyle in the country. property show, we remain committed to bringing the evolving real estate trends to life. You can find all these properties at our First Avenue offices. We can also arrange private viewing. At the expo, we also interacted with exhibitors, changing the face of our interior spaces. Our first stop, Sassire Designs. Let's have a look. That's the designs. We do interior designs. Main, that's our main focus. But we also divide it into three categories. We do interior design, um, branding and uh, corporate packaging. We also do events, for instance, um, Christmas events. We do the deco for the malls and things like that. So that is Sasai as a whole package. As you can see around, first of all, <laughs> we built the whole space with gypsum. Considering usually in expos you don't do that, so gypsum takes a long time, but we managed to do this in one and a half days. So I wanted to show that we're not just that interior part where you do the furniture but also the construction bit because we do design and build so I wanted to show how you know walls and ceilings and flooring how they all can play and merge all together into one holistic space the idea behind this is a I wanted to have two elements of the flooring and I didn't want to just divide the space into half so I went diagonally B, I wanted to also incorporate furniture, and furniture is from Paris Land, so they're the ones furnishing our space today. So furniture plays a big role also in interior design, because you know you can have the space, and once you put the right furniture in it, the space looks complete. And then also how lighting can work around the whole space. So we've got this new technological lights where you know you can embed it on the walls or on a wood platform and it's very seamless, it looks part of the space, but it brings out a lot of character in it, as you can see. And then on this side as well, is that instead of having just a plain wall, we added texture and volume and different, you know, also adding light to it, so it's very subtle, but it's very, uh, it adds to the whole character as well, yeah. <laughs> Why you should buy is because we're unique. We take every project as a unique, complete project, not to projects are the same you know we listen to what you want and we give you something that is very unique in terms of like the space and how you want it whether it's a home or an office or you know you name any interior item that you want and I'd like to add that I hope this inspires people to think of design in a different perspective than what we're used to I like to bring a different view in interior design something that is unique, something that is affordable at the same time. So my hope for interior design is that I'd like people to understand and appreciate what interior design is in terms of all the items that we can actually bring into this. Next, Manzil Designs, a solution to beautiful spaces for both home and office. Here is more.
Why should you choose Manzil Design over all other design companies we have in Kenya? We believe that we offer top-notch interior, both uh, for commercial and, and, and residential spaces. Um, when it comes to budget, we're able to work within your budget. When it comes to looks, we're able to give you the type of look you're going for. And on top of that, we are very transparent when it comes to our company. We're able to give you the end products that you envision from the beginning. As interior designers, we love to be involved from the beginning of a project. From the moment that you have your first architectural drawings out, that's when we like to be involved so we can go through the, the drawings and we are able to suggest to our clients um, what type of changes they can do rather than coming in very late in the project. So we love to be involved from the beginning of the project. My thought about the expo is that it's amazing. We, we love attending expos and this is one of the expos we've been looking forward to attend and uh, the outcome is very nice and we really love to see other other designers what they are able to bring on board and understand how creative rather i would say we are getting as a nation i really love it to be honest we've been enjoying each and every aspect of the expo and uh, the impact it has on us is that we're able to meet new clientele who want their either their houses or their offices renovated or re or done so it's very good for us so this is our outdoor space the color theme we went for is the yellow and blues and uh, we wanted to go for this very bohemian type of a feel and we were able to achieve that and courtesy of orca deco they're the ones who gave us the furniture and our grass is from desk tech kenya they are a flooring solution they have different types of grasses apart from the grass we have this beautiful lighting we got it from glow lighting and we chose this one because of we love glam. <laughs> Manzil, one of the things that we really love is the glam feel. So we wanted to have an outdoor that had that feel also. And uh, we did some lighting. And this is some, some of the things that we thought would bring the place uh, to life. Are you looking to add some glam, warmth and set the mood in your home? Creative Innovations got you covered with eco-friendly lighting solutions. We do deal with lighting, furniture, energy and lifestyle products. So today we are showcasing our latest projects that we've done with the lighting industries and we're also showing what we have under the energy department such as we have Jinko, we have some solar panels and we also have the storage like the inverters. The best part is because when you are working with us we tend to get to understand the customer's needs so as we're able to incorporate with whatever they have in mind and whatever they want to achieve and we promise more of high-end and quality products. This has been an amazing, amazing expo because first of all, we are getting to interact with our high-end market and based on also what other people have in different booths, they kind of complement each other. So we expect that it will also help us close more deals with the people who are coming here today. First of all, I want to introduce you to our latest projects that we've done. One of them is the trademark hotels where we had the signature pendants that were chosen by our team and their interior designers. As you can see, these are very new concept in the market because we are trying to come up with that coffee bean effect because we wanted to incorporate the Kenyan culture in the trademark hotel. This is their lobby, as you can see. And we also did the harvest restaurant where they wanted to achieve more of that farmhouse effect and we came up with these nice kind of pendants that fitted their space. We also did their conference rooms. It's one of the modern and top-notch conferences and we worked well to complement with what they had in their spaces. When you visit our showroom, you'll be able to see one of our latest range when it comes to our pendants. And we also do have most of the high-end switches in the market. And over here, you will see this statement piece. It's from Shula. It's one of our design range that comes from Spain. And we are able to do quite a lot with them 
because if you're looking for those statement pieces for your homes we are able to customize depending with whatever you want to achieve under the shula we also do have shula furniture it's high-end tables and also furniture that we have displayed in our showrooms this is something different from what you'll get in our kenyan market because the designs that we come up with and the concept is very different these are all from spain let me explain more about our ceiling lights and recess lights we do have some new designs of this surface mounted cylindrical lights they do come in the black bodies and white bodies we also have different wattages we have a 10 watt a 20 watt and 30 watt depending with the height of your ceiling you're able to have some different wattages because they'll give different outputs we also do have these track lights over here this can be used for both residential and commercial projects same case we do have them in 10 watts 20 watts and 30 watts we also do have these new developments when it comes to all the recess solutions we have some linear lights and we also have these recess track lights we also have different designs such that if you want to achieve a certain pattern in your ceiling you're able to arrange them in different ways that they'll be able to reflect in different ways creating some nice patterns in fact we did one of our projects over here this is at the bowling area at village market where the customer wanted something that will give them ample lighting and more functional lighting we chose to go with the linear lights because you are able to create some different designs with them and you can even mount them and connect them to create some different lengths as you can see from here we also have different kind of mood lightings these are the Philips items whereby we have the mood lightings. I'll just do a demonstration on how you can change the moods in your houses. We have this color changing fittings that you're able to even adjust the color temperatures and the different colors. We also have the Jinko. In fact, we now have the best storage area because it comes with an inbuilt lithium battery and the inverters and for this kind of project we are giving a 10 years warranty that's how we are able to also give warranties because the quality is top notch We wind up the accessory sports segment with White Elephant Trading Company offering a classic collection of handcrafted furniture made right here in Kenya. Let's find out more. So we do two things. We um, import antique furniture, which we restore um, in tribal African fabrics, mostly. Uh, and then the second thing that we do that we're showcasing here today is that we manufacture very classical furniture at our factory in Ngong. We've been operating for seven years, uh, the White Elephant Trading Company. Um, but this is a, this product is is only a year old, so it's a it's a new product for us. So I think the most unique thing about this product is that it's totally Kenyan made, um, and it's made with very very traditional upholstery techniques that not very many people even uh, know know about anymore. So for this market, other than the top fabric, which is a is a linen that we import, the whole piece of the furniture is, is made here in, in Nairobi. Number one, it's incredibly well made. I mean, this furniture will last lifetimes. I call it heritage furniture. Like you buy a piece of this, you'll be leaving it to your kids, your grandkids. By buying this furniture, you're using local Kenyan products and you're helping to employ Kenyan artisans. Like the skill of this to make furniture like this is not known by very many people. So it's a small group of people that you're supporting and, and helping us to continue to bring in younger people to, to train up to make this level of uh, quality furniture. So this explains how we kind of make our furniture. The, there's sort of three main points. The first is that we make our, our frames are made in 
prime grade dry timber and there's not a single nail or screw in the whole frame. Uh, the reason being that if you have nails or screws in the, in the frame, over time they'll work loose and you know when you sit on a piece of furniture it sort of squeaks and squeaks. That's because it's a nail moving in the wood. Um, so that will never happen with, with ours because we're, they're all joined with little dowels of wood. We then use the springing technique as, as a very traditional technique whereby we put in zigzag springs like this or in some of our other pieces we have a deep coil spring. We then put hessian and then a layer of koya with hessian on top which makes a pad which is stitched through onto the springs which means that you have a very nicely sprung base to the, the furniture like that which is then topped with foam and the fabric. On the arms and the, the body of the chair, we have like actually a five layer technique. So we first have the, the hessian on the frame. We then have a, a, a high density foam, then a medium density foam. Then we have a layer of cotton and then the top fabric is upholstered onto it. Um, the cushions are, are all made with uh, the base cushion is, is, is foam wrapped with Dacron and the back cushions are Dacron which are stitched through so they don't ever sag down. Um, and then ultimately like I was talking about our, all the legs of the furniture are made out of Mexican green ash um, and then they're topped with uh, brass casters that we import from the UK. Um, which is a very classic sort of European touch to the furniture. And that's kind of how they're constructed ostensibly. Next week, we'll feature our faithful Thailand carpet with new and interesting pieces for the home. Are you looking to spruce up your space this season? Just give us a call and we'll be happy to introduce you to our home decorators. Time for a short break. Coming up, a conversation on home loans with APSA. So for our customers, we will walk with you through this journey. It may seem tedious, but we are here for you. Just relax. Products captured during the expo. Experiences of home ownership journey. Study the market, ensure that you will not be, um, you will not regret. Other investment options available in the market. Don't go away, we'll be right back. Keep it property show. Welcome back. You're watching The Property Show. Owning a dream home is now becoming a reality thanks to affordable home loan products with APSA. about yourselves and what you do at APSA. I'm Martin. Uh, I run with real estate agents and uh, the scheme companies at APSA. My name is Joan Karioke Jenga. I support a product development at APSA 
and APSA is a leading financial institution present in over 12 uh, countries in uh, the African continent. We are also present in uh, the United States and the, the United Kingdom. And at APSA, we pride ourselves with being a true African bank. And our purpose is bringing possibilities to life. So bringing possibilities to life, Nancy, is also about making home ownership a reality to Kenyans. How are you supporting prospective homeowners? We know that people don't understand the process of the mortgage, people don't understand the process of construction finance. What support are you giving us? So Nancy, whether you are a first-time homeowner, whether you have been at the property market for a long time and you're looking to buy to invest, we encourage customers, come talk to us, let us walk with you through the journey. Part of the considerations that we will give are, have you identified a property? If you have not identified a property, we will help you do that. Have you spoken to any professionals? Have you done any due diligence? Whether it is on land, we will also help you identify professionals who can help you through that journey. We will also give you advice across the journey, whether it is financial, what you need to look out for, in terms of uh, any associated costs that are related on any mortgage transaction. So you're going to hold my hand all the way? I will hold your hand all the way. So there are many requirements across the mortgage journey. But you don't have to worry about thinking about whether it's construction, thinking about certificates, you know, the national construction certificate. We have you covered. Just come to us. Nancy, we've partnered with a wide range of properties, uh, affordable houses, and also the high-end types of properties. We are able to take the customer through this journey. This is whereby we are able to arrange property visit. And while you are taking the customer to see the property, we also pre-qualify the customer so that we can tell them this is how much you qualify for and this is how much you can afford. We also have solutions for corporate companies. Uh, these are the scheme companies. Uh, we have a wide range of scheme companies and here is whereby we negotiate and these customers are able to get housing and loans at a very affordable rate. Wow, wow. So which companies are these? Corporate companies or the government? We are both in the private sector and also the government. And let me add on the affordable housing, Nancy. So at APSA, affordable housing remains a key focus for us. We have partnered with Kenya Mortgage Refinance Company, KMRC, to ensure that we continuously support the government agenda of making affordable housing a reality for Kenyans. So now beyond buying a house, there is then what comes with the house. So there is furniture, there is electronics, there are a couple of things that go with the house. So we have partnered with uh, over 10 uh, different uh, furnishing companies and in there you get up to 25% discount on uh, the properties that have been selected. So it comes as a whole package and this is what we are offering, especially during this campaign period, Nancy. Tell us about the options available towards buying or building a home. Our loan tenors are one of the longest in the market. Can you imagine uh, having flexible terms up to 25 years? So I can pay my mortgage within 25 years? Within 25 years. Wow. It is quite flexible. The other consideration that we have is that customers want to know exactly what the process is about. So once you come to us, within 48 hours, you have an answer to do with are we progressing or not. And we want to ensure that we identify and customize a solution that only you, as Nancy, can walk the journey with. The other thing that we have, Nancy, Part of the mortgage process uh, entails a lot of uh, professional uh, costs that come with it. So over and above partnering with the uh, select uh, professionals, our lawyers, our valuers, we have gone the next step. And our next step is ensuring that our professionals are able to give discounts that are passed on to the clients so the customer can get that benefit. So for our customers, we will walk with you through this journey. It may seem tedious, but we are here for you. Just. Relax. And just to add to what my colleague Joanne is saying, we also do a product that is called Equity Release. This product is whereby if you own a home, we are able to give you equity up to 80% of the value of the property. With this money, you are able to use it to either buy a second home or improve the home that you are currently living in. 
your home with APSA. And construction is really one of the products that uh, we have at APSA. So whether you have already have your land or you want us to help you uh, get the land and build, uh, we have that option for you. So just come speak to us, we will walk you through the journey. And Nancy, construction sometimes can feel daunting. So you will be required to produce building plans, you'll be required to produce approvals, approvals from the city council. There's too much to worry about, but we will not make you do that hustle. Just walk to us. We have mortgage experts who will help you with that journey. Why choose APSA as your home loan solution partner? Number one, you get up to 90% financing of the value of your home. Secondly, you get interest rate of as low as 11.9%. Thirdly, you get an extended loan repayment period of up to 25 years, easing your monthly payment. Another tick for APSA, you get a comprehensive domestic insurance solution. You also get negotiated costs with third-party professionals. Another winner, you get a 48-hour response on your mortgage application. And the icing on the cake, you get discounted offers from home furnishing partners. It can't get better. The luxury living and design expo had everything. Next, a touch of nature with Greenwich, your one-stop solution for all kinds of indigenous plants and trees to complete your home. Let's see what they have to offer. Green Decos is a one-stop shop for all your green solutions, ranging from indigenous trees, potted plants, organic kitchen and landscaping. Uh, besides that, at the heart of conservation, we have a program called Mizizi, where we train people, especially children, intergenerationally on how to conserve the environment using our indigenous trees. At the driveway, we've just created a very nice walkway with indigenous trees such as Acacia, Gardenia Vocansai, or Bugia Ugadensis, uh, one of the trees that we believe they should restore our East African ecology. To pose a question and give a solution, the question is what is luxury living without sustainability? And for us we are saying if we conserve our environment using indigenous trees, when it comes even to landscaping using our indigenous trees, we'll be able to be sustainable as a country, not only as a country, but also as a region of East Africa. Yeah, for example here we have a dazzler plant. This dazzler is a a vibrant plant for your indoor space when we're talking about greening your office, greening your interior space, come for this plant available in this concrete pot design. You also have hanging plants for those who love falling gardens for your interior. We have the money plant. People say it's persistently rich, but why not? If you're green, then you're rich. And then we have a very unique plant here called Spanish moss all air plant. Feeds on nothing but air, you know. It grows with little maintenance, just air, and yet still it gives you that touch of plant indoors. We also have a lipstick plant, it's a hanging plant, which really fills in with your falling garden as well. Much more we have succulents. For example here, for your front desk, office, or interior, it's written Karibu. It's a little maintenance plant, it welcomes you home so that you feel like, ah, you need to take care of nature, you know. We also have a variety here showcasing some ceramic. For example, this one is a pala palm, a very good plant for indoors as well, and also it can do well outdoor. But the way it's vased, it's also good for indoor. On our African designed clay pots, this one is a gift. For example, if you are gifting someone for a birthday, you can buy them such a plant and then you put it in this. We say, the gift of evergreen love. You're passing that knowledge of sustainability and also conserving nature 
people to get to go green, not only going green in terms of energy, but also going green in terms of now getting the detail of the plant. Another winner at the expo during this cold season was Fireplace. Let's see what's available. Big Seasons Africa, where they're bringing in these um, beautiful electric fireplaces that give off heat and also have amazing ambience. Simply you just plug it in, uh, you mount it on the wall, you plug it in, or it can be inserted into the wall and it gives off heat at the top of the device if it's the wall mounted screen, or it can be inserted into the wall and uh, there's screens that give off heat from the front. So they're perfectly friendly to pets and children, not at all dangerous. It uses very little power indeed. Um, it uses only about 12 shillings and 50 cents per hour when the heat is on and absolutely a fraction of that when it's just for the ambient light. And the company has been going about four years um, and really ramped it up in the last year or so, supplying a lot of fires uh, to interior designers and architects for new and modern buildings. You should buy this electric fireplace because it will give you lots of warmth, lots of ambience. Um, it looks great and it's a clean energy. It uh, is not putting carcinogens into the air um, and it is economical in the long run. You've plugged in the unit, you've mounted it on the wall, um, you can just switch it off, um, switch it on again. I can then turn up the flame So you get more light. And then I put on the timer and switch on the heat and the heat starts to come out of the top of the unit. Give you, and this will warm a room up to about 35 square meters. So at night, you just, when you're going to bed, you simply press a button, as easy as switching off your television. together international architects changing the Nairobi skyline. Let's hear more from DND. Today we are showcasing uh, success stories we had with some developers. Uh, we are working together. We are uh, preparing the design part and they are working on the, the other parts of the project. We do the architecture and the interior design for this project and we create with them the whole story of the buildings that will come. Mostly it's residential here in Kenya, but we work on another types of development. Actually, we say we, we are trying to bring something unique and different to the market uh, to uh, provide different products where, than whatever is, uh, we used to have. The Oxpo is a very good idea, I like it. Uh, we like that mixing the design, the concept of, to bring the designers and meanwhile the product suppliers. Designers are like people doing a paint. You cannot paint without colors. So colors is our materials. So the architect, his material is colors. So if you combine them together in one place, that is the best and the perfect thing you can do. Up next, Home ownership stories with tales of searching for a family home and what to consider while at it. One of the things that I have to admit is that as much as it sounds that it was very fast, I took my time. At one point, I had said this, this market was going crazy on the pricing. And so uh, we had vowed we would never buy a house in Kenya at that price. Because in other places, you can actually buy a block of flats yes. at the same price. So we said, um, you know, it took time. 
we, we took about a year or so of uh, testing and saying, do we do it, do we not? You would read newspapers and say, you know, if you go in this area, you do get um, a return on your investment. And so we said, okay, let's now focus. So study the market, study the market, ensure that you will not be, um, you will not regret because we do have people who regret. You go to a far-flung area, your lifestyle adjusts so much, you begin to resent the space. So you, you find yourself letting the space out or the house out so that you can go back to where you felt your heart wanted. And so do your homework, take time, no one is rushing you. Most of the time, developers are also, you know, hoping you'll come back their way. Yes. It, it's never a rush. It's never a rush. Mm -hmm. If you find a sale or anything, you can always get a better deal. Yes. And so do your homework, compare, make sure that everything checks out. For me, key was children not having to sleep on the road in the morning mm -hmm. or sleep on the road on the evening. They leave when the sun is shining. They come back when the sun is shining. So that was key for me. I was happy not to frustrate other people in the family just because of where I wanted to live. I have to admit the conveyancing is the challenge in Kenya. It took a while. It takes a lot of personal effort to follow through on the legal aspects and ensure that someone is taking care of your business because many other people are using the same people, the same people. Ownership experiences tell the stories of the journey. If you have an interesting story, just give us a call and I'll be happy to share your joys and lessons learned along the way. Next, First Avenue with other investment options available in the market. My home, my life, is what defines Mivida Homes at Garden City. These apartments are meticulously designed by international and local consultants to offer comfort. Construction is ongoing for Phase 1, which comprises of 1, 2 and 3 bedroom apartments and is 70% complete. The residents will enjoy a spacious living area and dining room with a sliding door leading to a balcony area, a fully fitted kitchen with a door leading to adobe area and pantry area, common cloakroom for visitors and guests, an ensuite master bedroom, and an ensuite DSQ. Shared outdoor amenities will include 24 7 manned gate with a perimeter wall, CCTV surveillance camera, intercom system in each apartment, a kids' play area an adults and children's swimming pool, a clubhouse with a roof terrace, 300 meter long jogging track, barbecue areas, gym and fitness studio, multi-purpose sport court, boho water supply and a backup generator for the common areas. This development is in close proximity to schools, hospital and shopping centers. Tulisi Views offers a serene, secure and peaceful environment to live in. The first phase comprising of 28 units is nearly complete and occupancy is set for October 2021. Well, guess what? If you missed out on the first phase, you definitely don't want to miss out on this. Phase 2 of Tulisi Views will consist of 43, 3 and 4 bedroom villas. The homeowners will enjoy a covered entry porch, a spacious lounge area with a fireplace, an open plan fully fitted kitchen with high end appliances from Borch, a door leading to an ensuite DSQ, large windows for natural lighting, 
high ceilings and an ensuite bedroom fitted with wardrobes and laminate floors. The common amenities will include a guardhouse and security gate park cluster and in the main Tallisi Views entrance. A galvanized clear view steel fencing on the perimeter of Tallisi Views. A clubhouse with a children's play area, landscaped cluster courtyards, private garden space in each villa, paved footpaths and 6.8 kilometers jogging track, street lighting, street level visitors parking, provisions for ICT and cable TV, sewage treatment plants, borehole water supply, schools, hospital and shopping center will be in the vicinity, backup generator for common areas. The homes are set in an excellent location with great views. With value for money, these homes will sit on approximately eighth and quarter acre plots, respectively with a price ranging from 23.5 million to 37 million Kenya shillings. The lifestyle here will be equivalent to none. The environment makes this location truly enviable as it is designed to help you reach your entire essential and lifestyle services. First Avenue is our property arm for sales and rental. We have a large portfolio of properties in every price range. If you're looking for ideal opportunities, it's a good place to start. Just give us a call or visit our offices. Thank you for watching The Property Show. That's it for today. May I take this opportunity to thank the organizers of the Luxury Living and Design Expo for trusting The Property Show to tell their story. If you're looking to host an expo, we'd we'll be delighted to work with you. See you next week for another inspiring episode of The Property Show. Let's keep talking on our social media handles. As always, there is something for everyone. Kwaheri.